question number 15 a sphere of mass m and positive charge q is at rest midway between the two horizontal plates as separate by distance s yes. okay the potential difference across the plates is v so this potential difference is v so what is q he is asked us so now this is levitating here it's just levitating how can something levitate it can levitate only when the two forces acting on it is zero for example if i have this pen and ask it to levitate what should be there okay gravity is pulling it downwards and there should be one more force which would pull it upwards for example if this was something like an iron piece okay and there was a magnet on the top okay and if the magnetic force is higher than or is equal to the gravitational force definitely it will levitate right so that's what we have in a similar way here now what force is acting the negative charges here so therefore this will get attracted like this it will get attracted like this now, what is the force acting here this is nothing but your electrical force now, at the same time this also has a mass m see whenever in the problem there is a mass m and it's been conducted on earth though it is not given here separately but when you say it is an, it is it has a mass m it has a gravity associated so mg is acting here now what do you say when it is levitating which means sum of the upward force is equal to sum of the downward force and hence the object is not moving anywhere right so i can now write fe is equal to m into g right so therefore it is not moving anywhere now, what is fe a force electrical force acting on a charge q is given by q into e is equal to m into g what is e electric field between these two plates over here now what is electric field here electric field can be written as e is equal to v divided by d potential difference divided by the distance between the two plates what is the distance s yes, here so i will write this as v by s over here so i will substitute this in this equation and thus i will write q into v by s is equal to mg what do i need mg over here what do i need over here it says what is q you need to find out the value of q so therefore q should be equal to mgs divided by v so this should be your answer mgs by v answer is d